This is a dental dam demonstration. A dental dam is a piece of material that lowers the risk of STIs during oral sex on a vulva or anus by providing a barrier between one partner's vulva or anus and the other partner's mouth. It can be quick and easy to make a dental dam. You will need one condom and one pair of scissors. If someone is allergic to latex, they can use a latex-free condom. Any condom that says it protects against pregnancy, STIs, and HIV is made out of a material that works. Before using a condom, there are two things to check. The first is the expiry date. Condoms break down over time. Check the expiry date printed on the condom package or on the box. This one has not expired yet, so it would be good to use today. The second thing to check is that the package does not have any holes and that it looks like it's in good condition. To do this, squeeze the package and make sure to feel for a pocket of air, like a bag of chips. That shows there are no holes in the condom package. Now is a good time for a reminder. Condoms need careful storage. They are sensitive to heat, cold, folding, sunlight, and rubbing. I am now ready to open the condom package. To open a condom, push the condom over to one side and then rip down the other side of the package. Be careful. Fingernails and jewelry can damage condoms. Never use teeth or scissors to open a condom package. While the condom is still rolled up, cut the tip of the condom off. Keep the condom rolled up and put the scissors through the middle and cut through one side of the ring. Unroll the condom. You now have a rectangular piece of material to be spread out over a vulva or anus and act as a barrier. Place the dental dam over the vulva or anus. Lubricant can help the dental dam to stick to the skin so it stays in place. You can also hold it in place. It's important each partner only touches their own side of the dental dam. This way, each partner's skin and body fluids do not touch the other person's. After sex, carefully fold the dental dam up, only touching your own side. Throw it in the garbage, not in the toilet, because it can clog your toilet or wreck your septic system. Use dental dams one at a time and use a new dam each time you have sex. If you switch sexual activities, like going from oral sex on an anus to oral sex on a vulva, use a new dam. Remember, safer sex is all about protection, consent, and communication. For information and services about sexual and reproductive health in your area, visit ahs.ca slash srh, call 811 for HealthLink, or talk to your healthcare provider.